Right, this is the best part of the movie. The clown's the killer. The film is called Conquest. It's by Lucio Fulci. Conquest is about a hero named Ilias, and he gets this magic crossbow. He must go out and be a man so that he can activate this magical bow and arrow, and then he can shoot people with the power of the sun. He meets up with a barbarian. It's like the Conan series, which it rips off. There are unbelievable scenes of gratuitous violence. The land that he goes to is ruled by a witch. That witch is topless for the entire movie. There's not really any plot. I mean, to be really quite honest, the hero looks like he walked out of Fellini Satyricon. So he is the least buff, least beefcake, uh, sort of Italian sword and sorcery hero you ever saw. My absolute favorite thing about the movie is this scene where they murder this guy and steal his meat. And he says, there are no rules if you're hungry. Wow, these are like human beings crawling up out of the muck and the slime, and they're just trying to figure out what it is to be human. The barbarian learns to um, be civilized. So it's actually probably Fulci's most moral movie. Fulci works with destroying the human body. He's an atheist, but he's making the inferno over and over and over again. It exists in this dream state. He says, I'm just gonna make a nightmare out of this and gonna brain a lot of people. <laughs> it's got a um, soundtrack by, I think, Claudio Simonetti of the Goblins. I cannot in good conscience recommend it to anybody. But at the same time, you should go and buy it. If they have it on Blu-ray, go get it. Minky, how could you? Hi. Like, comment, please subscribe. For the record, my movie choice would have been The Keep by Michael Mann, 1983.